I have a question. How many of you like to cook? <laughs> I cannot cook. Uh, every time I, I try to cook, my house fills up with so much smoke, it looks like the inside of Snoop's tour bus. It's, <laughs> I really appreciate people who can cook because it is not easy and it's even more complicated nowadays. There's always some new technique that's coming out. And have you heard of this new molecular gastronomy? Have you heard about that? Yeah. It's, uh, it's, it rolls right off the tongue is what it does. <laughs> Um, anyway, uh, what they do is they use all of these crazy cooking methods like liquid nitrogen, which is minus 350 degrees. So instead of heating the food, it freezes it instantly, you know, because we needed another way to lose a finger in the kitchen. Um, <laughs> So I guess the idea is to play with the texture and the look of food, which can make it completely unrecognizable. And I went to one of these restaurants uh, one, one day, and I accidentally ate two candles and a napkin, because I... <laughs> it's crazy complicated, and I, and I... You know what? I just want cooking to be simple. And by simple, I mean done for me. So I thought I would bring someone here to cook for me right now. Please welcome Curtis Stone. <laughs> Something has either gone terribly wrong. Did you want it to Something's do that? Something's happening here. See, this All is right. why you want to be in front of your food when you're cooking it. Yeah. No, this is good. This is good. Okay. So there's, you have a new restaurant called Maud. Right. And it's in Beverly Hills. Yes. And I want to go. I haven't been yet, but I, I hear in. great things. I want yeah. to. And you have like a different, you feature a different food, right? Right. And today it is? Cucumbers. So what we do is we take one ingredient and then we do like a 10 course tasting menu out of that one ingredient. So as a part of our creative process, we try and figure out all the different things we can do with that one ingredient. Uh -huh. So I thought I'd show you a few of our methods. Because I, I love cucumbers, so this is really working out for me. Very what, good. What's happening? So over here, well, what we've done first of all is we've just made a lemonade. So I'm going to show you, and, th and then I've taken the juice of cucumber and turned it into these beautiful little bubbles. All right, so this is how a soup would come out. But if you want something more simple, you literally just pour yourself some cucumber lemonade and then some of those cucumber bubbles on top. And it can be a nice garnish for a... Uh, the bubbles just stay? They don't ever go away? Well, they'll slowly, they'll slowly dissipate, but they'll, they'll stay for long enough for you to taste it. Okay. Let um, me taste this. <sighs> That's refreshing. <laughs> that with vodka would be amazing. <laughs> well, it just so happens that... Uh, oh, if you want great. Like... Chaser. I like that. Cucumber chaser. Yeah. Good job. All right. That's delicious, though. So one thing we do at the start of the month is we say, what are all the different forms we can get it in? So this is actually a micro version of cucumber. So taste this little guy. What do you mean a micro? This doesn't look anything this, like a cucumber. This is cucumber. I don't believe you. Really subtle, but you get the flavour? Yes, but, but how is this a cucumber? So you, you just start growing them. That's how they begin. So it's, uh, oh. it's a micro version. Wow. Um, so we're going to do a salad, but the, the star of this ingredient, the star of this salad, because I've got onions and a little vegan cheese, some uh, olives, some uh, chervil or parsley, a quick dressing. So you make a really quick, simple salad, but then to bring it to life, what I'm going to do is smoke some cucumber. So I've taken cucumbers and just cut them in half. That's legal now in like California, this. right? It is legal in California. <laughs> um, and I have a little, <laughs> a little smoke gun here. So we just light this little smoke gun up and then we cover this with cling film. Okay. And you let that smoke gun sort of fill the bowl. And look, you can smoke anything, of course. Uh, <laughs> fruit, pro protein. <laughs> okay, so that goes off. Um, and then you capture all that smoke, and you wouldn't believe the flavour of how smoky that cucumber actually becomes. I'm going to cut you just a little piece, just to, so you can see okay. how smoky it can become. Um, hope it's not too hot. <laughs> it's not too hot. It's okay, delicious. So, so that would be the garnish of the salad on the, on the cucumber. Mm hmm Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do a stir-fry with cucumber, which is a little out of the box. And I brought a little toy along. Mm -hmm. This is the spiralizer. Mm. Right, so what you do is you just gently sort of use Can a I little force. Yeah, come on. Okay. You're and you, ha there. you have kids, right? I do, two boys. And do they cook? They do. And see, look how long it gets. 
So it's like, yeah, it's instead these... of the noodles, right? Right. Healthier. Like... Perfect. Okay. Good job. Thank okay. you. So to do the stir fry, um, we start with uh, a little oil that I can't see, but let's just go with garlic, <laughs> onion, and chili. Do you need oil? Oh, yes. Good this job. Could be Thank the... you. I don't know what this is, yeah, but it no, looks over... like it might be oil. Just a little. Okay, grab the cucumbers and toss them in there. All right. So we're making kind of a pad thai. So the cucumber is yep. actually going to act as your noodle in this dish. That's what I said. And because you don't have to, you don't have to cook it very much. Mint, some more of that cucumber, uh, micro cucumber, and some basil. Oh, this looks delicious. And then a little of the um, sauce. What is the sauce? Chili, brown sugar, a little soy, and you toss that together. Look at that. Do we and have an overhead shot, like a cooking show? Because it really looks... Oh, look at that. Yeah. Your people are good. Yeah. OK, so that gets tossed together. Uh, and then you finish it with some peanuts. OK. And what's the lime for? Just like... So the lime you can just squeeze over the top. OK, so just a few drops. You don't want too much. And then... <laughs> You just serve it like that, and you've got yeah, a that was so stir, quick. Fry, stir fry in seconds. That was amazing how quick that was. And then dessert, I've done a little granita, which is, um, uh -huh. have you all heard of a granita before? So this is like a refreshing she, little... She has. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> One person, that's so it. Good. So it's, it's, it's cucumber ice. It's a cucumber ice, uh -huh. but you sweeten it up, you add a little sugar and you bring it to the boil. Mmm, with vodka, this would great. <laughs> <laughs> And the idea is you freeze it and then you just run a fork over it so you continue to make that ice. So, you know... That is delicious. Thank you. Wow, all of this is delicious. And so all of this is at Maud. Right. In Beverly Hills. That's right. And, uh, and everyone is going to go there later. I can't pay for it, but I you should go. <laughs> I, I saw what I just said and I saw all of you like... <laughs> the big Thank you, Alan. Yeah. Isn't that generous of her? <laughs> it's on you. <laughs> Can I tell you a funny story? Yes, please. I was, my wife told me never try and be funny with a comedian because it really backfires, but I was driving past your studio when Hudson was about um, nine months old, maybe, maybe a year, so he's just getting a few words out like dada. And we drive by your studio and there's a big photo of you. And we actually have a very similar dress sense. Yes, we do. Right? Not so, right now, but we do. Sweater yes. over the top of a, yeah. you know, collared shirt. And anyway, he we drove by and he looked up and he saw you and he went, Dada. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Which I thought it was pretty funny. Something anyway. I've been meaning to tell you. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> That's adorable. No, I know. The last time you were here, I thought that. I thought that we actually have a similar style. No, we do. Um, we and do. your wife is going to be in a show that I'm producing. Yes. It's very exciting. Very You'll exciting. hear about it soon, but that's really exciting. Mm -hmm. Go to our website to learn more about Curtis's restaurant called Maud that you'll all go to on your own dime. <laughs> and we'll be back.